Uh, there's been a lot of digital native brands. Um, you know, the barriers to entry for, for launching new brands is much lower. Uh, however, it's been much more difficult to reach your target audience and to reach them at scale, right? So a lot of fragmentation, as you know, in the media space and in the marketing channels. So some that have broken through that have done well, Madison Reed, a great digital native brand, and I'll speak in, in, in the beauty space, Kylie Jenner, also a billion two uh, out of a, a product that she launched digitally. Uh, you can start there, and there is an advantage uh, to some degree. Um, there's time to market advantage. What I've seen that's interesting, and it's not quantitative, it's qualitative, but a lot of those digital native brands, in order to continue to grow, actually look to physical footprint, right? So in the case of Madison Reed, um, Madison Reed opened their own uh, kind of boutiques and shops, which are phenomenal. Digital native brands are here to stay. And I do think from a growth perspective, there is the opportunity around physical, either opening up your own stores or boutiques or having some kind of a physical presence.